Hey everybody, today we're going to talk about our Digital Friday lesson for this week, which is really just a tiny assignment and a tiny presentation or mini presentation. Um, it's going to be about something that is important to you. And so our directions are right here in the assignment. You're going to find something in your home and give a quick presentation on what it is and why it's so important to you. So find something important to you. It could be a valued object that you have. Uh, like jewelry or something that was passed down to you or maybe something that you worked really hard for. Um, it could be a pet, so like an animal. It could even be somebody that lives with you. It could be a person, okay? So anything that's important to you, you can present. Your presentation should be at least 20 seconds long, but no longer than a minute. There's a one-minute limit on how much you can record, and so it'll stop you at one minute. I actually did an example video, and it I struggled to get under one minute. I just barely made it. So, uh, but you just have to do at least 20 seconds, less than a minute. When you're done, you're going to upload your submission into Flipgrid. You don't have to worry about uploading anything into Canvas. Okay. There's a link down here. It's going to take you directly into Flipgrid to complete your mini presentation. And, uh, when you're in Flipgrid, you do have to log in with Google. So you're just going to use your normal Granted SD Google account that you log into your Chromebook with. Um, if you're at home, this is an important note or some other location that allows you to have a mask off, please show your face. So Avid's like one big family. We all kind of support each other. We encourage each other and we help each other reach our goals. And it'll be nice to see everybody's face and um, I'm looking forward to it. I'm sure everybody else is. So um, one note though, if you have to wear a mask because there's like a health reason um, or you're in some kind of public place and there's a mask requirement obviously in public, public places, um, just make sure that if you are going to wear a mask and you have to, speak loudly and clearly so we can still hear you, okay? So we're going to go ahead and click on the link. It'll take us into Flipgrid. I'm already logged in, so I didn't have to log in, but your first step will likely to be logging in with Google, okay? Then you're going to record your response. Um, I record an example here so you can watch it when you get a chance, and it's just about um, Chip, our dog, as you can see from the title. And that's my daughter. She helped me out. So if I click record, and then the video thing will pop up, and wow, it's greasy. Let's try some different lighting here. Looks like I'm greasy no matter what. I need to take a shower, but um, so here we are, and uh, you can see the video. When I'm ready to record, I'm going to hit record. And uh, I was going to put a shirt on. My daughter was like, you have a shirt on. And I was like, well, it's a tank top. She's like, you're fine. doesn't matter. You're not at school. I was like, all right, whatever. I'm with that. Um, she, uh, She's the voice of reason, so I, I trust her judgment. Anyway, so you're going to record your video. As you can see up here, it has a time limit, less than a minute. tells you where you're at, how many seconds you have left. And then once you're done with your video, you're going to stop it wherever you're at, hit next. And then you're going to review the video. You're going to watch it. Do, do I like it? Do I not like it? You can add more. You can go back and delete it. Um, but you can edit it in this in this break. All right, when you're ready. Sorry. Um, so you can add to it. You can delete stuff. You can start over. When you're ready, you're going to click. You're going to click next. Um, you have to give a selfie at the end just to like go with your video. Um, so you just picture of you or your object or. It's up to you. So there we go. That's good enough. There's no rules on the selfie. Must be school appropriate, obviously, but um, you don't have to like show your entire face. It could be, you know, something silly. And I'm ready for that. And I hit next. It's going to process my video and then it's going to ask me to give it um, a title. And so I'm going to make sure I, you don't have to give it a title. It says optional. Your name is going to be on there. As you can see, your display name. Make sure it's your name that I can actually give you points on. So don't change your name to something crazy that I don't understand. Make sure it's a name that resembles your actual name so that I can give you points for your assignment. Um, I gave mine a title. You don't have to give yours a title. And then when you're ready, you're going to click submit. Okay. I'm going to close this because I don't want to submit that because that was ridiculous. And then um, once you're done and you submit it, you'll be able to see everybody else's video. Feel free to watch a, cu a couple different ones and enjoy seeing each other's faces and learning a little bit about important 
objects, people, and animals. All right. Um, good luck on the assignment. If you have any questions, please message me in Canvas, and uh, I'll try to help you out. Hopefully this video helps you understand what to do, and good luck.